If you're looking to either improve your CSGO video settings or your config settings, or you're just simply looking to boost your FPS in CSGO, stick around because I'll be going through all of those settings in today's video. Also, I'll be sharing my config settings and my video settings because apparently I've gotten a lot of requests for it. So if you have a shit PC and you want to boost your FPS, make sure to first of all put these launch options in. Make sure to adjust the minus threads to the amount of threads your CPU has and also set the minus rec and the minus refresh to the hertz frequency of your screen. I've currently set my own threads to 4 and I've also set my frequency to 144 hertz because I currently use a 144 hertz screen. The next thing you want to do is download the FPS benchmark map on CSGO. It's a workshop map where you can benchmark your FPS but it also offers you to do some extra settings. So just download the map and shoot at the settings and that way you can apply them. As of right now you can probably already tell you've got a little bit more FPS if you didn't apply those settings before. I don't really know too much about the actual video settings but obviously if your PC is bad put everything on low and if your PC can handle a little bit more turn the settings up to your likings but this is all preference and I don't really think these settings matter too much. What does matter though is your resolution. Now I currently play on 4x3 and a 1440 by 1920 resolution. If you want to know how to do that stick around because I'll show you guys later on in the video but for now if you're playing in 1920 by 1080 and you see that you're lagging turn that shit down just put it on like 720p and see how that goes. Obviously the game is going to look a little bit more awful but your FPS will go up by a lot. So if you really want to get a better FPS boost I'd recommend playing in 4x3 because you obviously have to render less pixels as it crops up your screen and therefore you obviously get more FPS. So if you want to play in 4x3 but you do not want to play with the black bars on the side make sure to open up your Nvidia settings and make the aspect ratio stretched. However if you're not using an Nvidia video card make sure to check out the link in the description I've left some tutorials on how to apply these settings on different video cards. So if you want a higher 4x3 resolution instead of whatever CSGO provides open up your Nvidia settings or whatever video card you're using their settings and go to resolution. From here you're able to add a custom resolution and my custom resolution is 1440 times 1920. This is still a 4x3 resolution but because the pixels are higher it still gets cropped up into your 1920 by 1080 screen. The reason why I like the 1440 times 1920 resolution is because I used to play in 1080p and I didn't want to lose too much pixel quality when playing in 4x3 so this was a pretty good option for me and you might like it as well. So those were some tips and tricks on how to improve your FPS. I still wanted to include this in the video even though it was really basic because I thought just showing you guys my settings in this video would be boring but now I'm going to show you guys my settings anyway. So the settings I use are pretty simple. I've put everything on the lowest except for my shader detail which is set on high. Multicar rendering is enabled because that is something that's in the launch options. My multi sampling anti LA whatever mode is off because I don't even know what that is. My FXAA anti LEA sing is enabled because obviously you don't want to hear LEA singing. That would be fucking horrible. My texture filtering mode is bilinear. My waiting for vertical sync is disabled and so is my motion blur. Now I want to get into my config because this is something you guys have been requesting a lot from me too. I have already made a video on how to make yourself the best config and I've also showed my old config. So in today's video I'll be showing you guys my config again and I'll leave a link to that video in the description down below if you want to customize your own best config. Because I do not know exactly what my config is anymore I went to the crash view model generator map. From this map you can tweak your own settings and you can also export your settings which I'll do right now and I'll leave them in the description down below. I will do the exact same thing for my crosshair because I do not know exactly what I've done with my crosshair over time but on the crash crosshair map you can also export your crosshair settings and share them with other people which I'll also do so that will also be in the description down below. So that's basically a whole lot of description work but everything that I'll be talking about in this video will be in the description so you guys don't miss out on anything. So I guess that would be it for today's video but if you guys want me to make a video on a different topic let me know in the comments down below because I personally want to do more commentaries on my channel and I just really want to use my voice for more videos instead of just CSGO gameplay. So I help you out with some tutorials and you help me out with some ideas. I think that's a pretty fair trade.